let me guess, you wanted a brand new Radeon RX 1700 XTX or XT for Christmas, even though that would be one expensive Christmas present. But the joke is on you, because they're already sold out everywhere. That's right, the indiscriminate scalping of graphics cards is still going on. And if you want to get them in the unimportant slums of the world that are countries other than the United States, well, tough luck, you aren't getting them anywhere. And when you wake up on Christmas Day, all you're going to have is disappointment and tears because this is still going on. And do you know how many Chinese sweatshop, <clears throat> I mean Santa's owls, had to give up the weekend plans to just be able to create these cards they can't even get for Christmas now. But don't worry, because soon all of humanity will be punished for our inefficiencies. That's right, if you're hoping to escape the Team Green greed by going for a Team Red card instead, well guess what, you're gonna have to pay Team Green prices anyway for a scalped one on eBay, because these things sold out fast. However, don't worry, because there is still a strange light in the tunnel. And by that I mean that the product isn't even officially out yet, it's pretty much just been a paper launch. And that all means two things. One, maybe in the future these cards won't be as heavily scalped, and two, well you just simply have to wait even longer to get your hands on these. Because even though they officially launched earlier in December, it didn't really feel like one. Because even if you look on any online retailer site, the amount of SKUs of this graphics card is strangely low, with a lot of them just being the base $1,000 or $900 reference card models just from different companies. And I think that the biggest piece of evidence is actually AMD's own Instagram thingy. Uh, post thing, st story thing, I don't know what it's called, I have no idea what Instagram even is. Like, I know it's my entire job to be good at social media, but like, I just don't know anything about Instagram, okay? But either way, in AMD's special end of year wrap up, they did mention about how they launched a brand new Ryzen 7000 CPUs, but they also stated that they announced the Radeon 7000 graphics cards, not launched, announced the same language they shared with the Epic CPUs as well. And this change in language means that most likely we are looking at a classic example of a paper launch, which given current supply issues and the fact that some cards are still in very, very low supply, looking at you RTX 2090, I guess it does make sense that they would prefer to do a paper launch rather than have people very, very disappointed. Which granted, it is probably still very disappointing to many people, they can't grab this thing for Christmas, but still. At least when these things do come out, they should provide some much needed competition. But anyway, back to you Christmas of Runner. Thanks on Christmas of Runner, and if you want to give the gift of this channel not dying, then maybe check out our Patreon, because even a single dollar a month truly goes a long way this Christmas season, while you get awesome perks as well. I'd also like to thank my existing patrons, Gavin Burns, Ryan, Oki Beach, Rage, and Avronyak, Bardos Volka, Meg Sumner, Shane Allcroft, Lenthby, and Jesse Herbman. Thank you guys so, so much, support truly goes a long way. Down you can find our merch store, our Discord server, and our social media links as well. But anyway, that's about it, so I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, then remember to subscribe, like, whatever, and I'll see you all in whatever I make next. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye, and Merry Christmas.